heard it on the radio the other day on a local radio station. The host said that if you do not wear Lululemon leggings and you're not a true Vancouverite, go leggings. <laughs> My favorite store, Holt Renfrew. Actually, this is just one of the entrances. You can see the here. You see the Holt Renfrew, and then because Chinese New Year is coming up, it says Sunlin Fai Lo Gong Hei Fa Tai. Let's go in. Oh, these are nice. There's a new Dior's. By the way, this is my outfit. See ripped jeans, my belt, and then I have a, my new blazer, and then my coat on top. We are in downtown because Grace, she notified me that my toiletry has arrived, so I'm here to pick it up. And also, uh, hubby and I have date night, so we're gonna have a nice dinner at the tea house which is in Stanley Parks. Tea House is one of those um, venues that we considered for our wedding a couple years ago. Actually, it's almost three years now. So it's actually really nice facing the, the ocean, but it was too small for our wedding. So here I go. Oh, hi. <laughs> hi, Grace. Hello. Hello. <laughs> She's busy with the client, but I'll wait for her. <laughs> <laughs> Very busy today because we all love Louis Vuitton. It's a Saturday. Anyway, isn't this a gorgeous, gorgeous color for the twist? I think this is looks like the Coquelicot. I can't go closer because there's someone here, but and here's the beautiful clutch that I'm dreaming about. This is the exact same print that I would like it in. So beautiful. Oh, they have it on display today. This is very nice. This is the necklace that I got. This is a little uh, cosmetic pouch that um, I had base order in for me. It's really cute. It has a pink leather interior. Too bad it's a little on the small side, otherwise I would have been grabbing this too. It's so cute. <laughs> it's called the Pochette Rivet, or online I think they just call cosmetic pouch. I'm trying to twist MM. This is crossbody, but I do have two jackets, so I'm wearing quite thick of a layer, and it still looks okay. It does look good. It's really cute. Oh, sorry, it's okay. To adjust the thing. Oh my gosh, you guys, I love this bag. I really want to get it now. I think I have to save up. Oh, so nice. It's amazing. This bag is amazing, amazing, amazing. I love it, I love it, I love it. It's so me, it's so crazy how much I love it. Oh, hello! How are you? I think you look pretty good. So the sun is setting, it is 5.29 now. Actually, the sun is supposed to officially set at 4.53, but you can still see some of the orange from the sky. So we are on our way to Stanley Park. We're take, uh, you're not in the screen, hun. And um, yeah, so I guess this is kind of like the scenic route. We're on our way to Tea House. The restaurant is called the Tea House. You said this is called the Inokshuk? Mm -hmm. What is it supposed to symbolize? The native people? It's Inuit. I 
with that tree that's on top of the building. Oh yeah. Not like a way of it is a way. No, but <laughs> there's no light fixture in the park at night, so it is completely pitch black. Try not to walk here by yourself at night because you never know if you're gonna encounter a coyote. I guess there are some light fixtures on parts of the road. Here is uh, basically the ocean, the Pacific Ocean. You really can't see much more other than a little bit of the lighting. But the tea house is facing the water, which is the reason why I really love it. And here in the far distance, that's, I think it's North Vancouver. And here is the tea house, which is the restaurant. I think it says free parking. Right here. I guess we are coming for their dine out event. Um, I suppose it's one of those things that restaurants do so that you get to try you know the food at the restaurant I want to show you that I have my clip or two right here so holding on to my beautiful bag which you can't see because it's really dark in here design out menu you have the choice of these appetizers and trays desserts and you can enhance your menu by choosing those two options there uh, I'm contemplating the I don't know either the soup or the cauliflower and the duck confit and then for dessert we're probably just each of us gonna choose one so we can get a taste of both but then in the enhancement menu I think that grilled lamb chops looks pretty good too It has more or less been the same. I mean, there were maybe a couple of days where I was able to wear my diamond ring, sort of the engagement ring, but for the most part, it's been quite inflamed. So my ring finger is still quite big. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. And uh, yeah, so I'm a little bit sad about that because I really like to wear both rings. Uh, I guess luckily I can still wear my wedding ring but hopefully one day I'll go down if not I have to resize my diamond rings tomato soup and here's the Tuscan salad here's my duck confit it smells really good and my husband's is even more amazing look at that rack of lamb and sausage oh even has shrimps and finally here's our creme brulee yep I changed my mind I went with creme brulee and hubby went with creme brulee too all right guys it was really loud inside so I couldn't finish off the vlog inside but I think I'm gonna end the vlog here and I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me again all right Talk to you guys later. Bye!